Thursday, April 16th, and hear some of the news beyond the headlines. Dozens of farmers have committed suicide after unexpectedly heavy rains destroyed wheat fields across northern India. The chief secretary from Uttar Pradesh state said more than 41 farmers had killed themselves in the last two weeks. The province has declared a state of emergency and has set aside $81 million to compensate affected agricultural workers for their losses. Nearly 70 percent of Indians rely on agriculture for their daily income. An oil spill has left hundreds of thousands of people without drinking water in Mexico's southern state of Tabasco. The spill was caused when thieves tapped into an oil pipeline, causing it to leak into area rivers. Five water treatment plants have been forced to close because of the contamination. Faucets remain dry, and officials say they will have to supply residents with water from tanker trucks until the rivers are clean. A shipping company in Poland is using drones to help catch thieves that steal coal from their trains. PKP Cargo noted a 32 percent drop in theft after drones recorded the faces and license plates of the criminals. Thieves often block the tracks, forcing trains to make an emergency stop and then unload the coal into cars. Over 900 robberies occurred last year, costing the company millions of dollars. A Japanese artist faces charges of obscenity for making and distributing objects modeled on her vagina. Megumi Igarashi was arrested last year for making a kayak with the top shaped like her lady parts. She faces up to two years in jail if found guilty. Igarashi told reporters outside the court that Japan is still backwards when it comes to women's sexual expression. Depictions of female genitalia remain taboo in the country, while in some fertility festivals, giant penises are paraded openly through the streets. Check out the Vice News YouTube channel for more original reporting and documentaries from around the world. Antes de que entre erradicación, entra de vida, hablarles que, que la, de, sobre la coca, que es algo ilegal, todo. ellos tienen conocimiento, por eso hay un plan alternativo acá, creo que, que es productos alternativos, cacao, café, y muchas veces ya no lo han cumplido, ahí recién se entra lo que es erradicación.